guys, welcome to another NBA 2K13 pack opening in my team mode. Um, you see my record there, 1 and 2 in the second seed? Well, guess what? Uh, guess what? I already got to the first seed. I completed my team. I got MJ. Um, I was playing in the first seed and I lost, like, I think it was four games. So then it, like, booted me down to the second. And then I haven't really been putting up good lineups, as you can see right here. I got some of the guys who aren't that great playing against these superstar teams. So I've been kind of messing around. I don't really care if I win at this point. I mean, they're, you're not really fighting for anything. But uh, let's get into this pack opening. I wanted to talk about some of the players I have, who are my favorite players to play with, and some players I really want to get. So uh, let's start with the players I already have that I really like. Um, I have to say my favorite player to play with in my team is Clyde Drexler. He is a 93 overall. He's a really good dunker. Has a really good mid-range shot. He can finish inside. And he's a shooting guard. And he was one of the main reasons I was able to get to the first seed. I used him a lot. And I just loved playing with him. I don't know what it was. I just I just really liked it, and uh, I also like Kendall Gill. You saw him in that lineup I showed earlier. Another good dunker. Uh, let's see. Bill Russell was really good for me. I like him because he's athletic. He'll get out on the break, and he's also a really good defender and rebounder. Offense is not really there for him, but I mean, me I'm a fast break guy. I like to get out on the break and run. So he really helps me in that area. Uh, MJ is not as fun as I thought it would be to use him. Get a John Thompson right there. Uh, he's not, I mean, he's the best player in the game, but I don't know. I just don't find it that fun to use him. <laughs> Call me crazy, but I just don't. I mean, I ha I've only used him like three times in a game, so that's kind of proof. Now let's, I actually want to do this too. Some of the players I dislike. I don't like Larry Bird. Larry Bird is like awful in my mind. I can never get his jumper right. I don't think anyone can. Unless you use him a lot and you got his jumper down. But the only way you're going to score a jumper, the only way I'm going to score a jumper is if I'm doing like a momentum shot or I'm like fading or like a hop step or something like that. And his on-ball defense isn't that high. He has a good steal rating, so you can kind of get away with him playing on defense. That's like the second grade Popovich we've got. Whatever. All right, let's see. Who else do I not like? Hmm. Percy Hawkins. I'm not sure if I like him because he has a 93 three-point. But I don't feel he does. The reason I say that is, I was playing this game down the stretch in the second seed, a really big game, and like I think I was down by like I don't know four or five maybe. But I have Hersey Hawkins in the game, and he's coming up to the three-point line. I give it to him. Takes a wide open shot, perfect release and everything. The shot quality was an A, and he missed it. So I'm like. All right, that happens once in a while. But then, next possession, come down, give it to him again. Wide open shot, perfect release again. And he bricks it again. So he missed two open threes in a row, which pretty much killed me. And then, at the end of the game, I was down by like eight or nine. And I was like, oh, forget it. I just want to make a three with Hersey Hawkins. Take another one, wide open. A rating for the third time. Misses it again. So what I'm thinking is he either has a low consistency rating or something's messed up with his shot rating. But like other times I've used him, he's been able to make the three. So I don't really know what's up there. Um, all right, let's transition into players I would like to get. Now, I counted yesterday and I have 21 gold legends. And... Let's see. I think the player I would like to get 
the most would probably be Dominique Wilkins. Um, he's pretty rare. I actually think he's more rare than Iverson because I've played more people with Iverson than I have Wilkins. And the reason I would uh, want Dominique over Iverson, ooh, get Irvin Johnson. I've never got him before, so that's pretty cool. The reason I'd like to get Dominique over Iverson is, like I said, I'm a fast break guy. I like to get out and dunk, and Wilkins is perfect for that. He's not a great three-point shooter, and I don't take a lot of threes, so he fits my playing style. I mean, yeah, you could argue Iverson doesn't make a lot of threes either, but uh, he, he's more of a uh, slow it down, shoot a mid-range. Uh, he's also a good finisher, but... He's not just going to be destroying someone in the paint. So, I guess I would like Wilkins as my first player and Iverson as my second. <clears throat> and, let's see. There's still a lot of gold legends out there. Oh, let me talk about some players I dislike playing against. One person I hate playing against is Sean Kemp. Sean Kemp is just, he just dunks on everyone. Like, literally everyone. He's a power forward, played for the Supersonics. And if he gets inside, he's pretty much going to dunk it or finish. And I, I, just, I just hate playing against him every single time. So, I kind of hope I don't get him, if that sounds stupid. And, uh... Let's see. Come on, we need a gold legend. I've gone through like 60,000 BC, seriously, without a gold legend. So, I'm kind of getting mad right here. Let's see, come on. I've also been playing a lot of my career lately. I mean, my team's not that fun anymore. Now that... <clears throat> now that I beat it and there's not really any point in playing it except for having fun. So I play a couple games every once in a while now. But I kind of want to get some more legends to play with. Kind of, I don't know, restart my team if you want to call it that. But my career's been going pretty well. I've got a shooting guard in the Hornets. I didn't get drafted to them. Oh, we get Bill Bridges. Alright, alright. That's cool. Uh... I think he's a pretty good dunker, so that's probably going to fit my play style. I'll look at him right now. Oh, he has an A-plus rebounding for a power forward? Wow. All right, definitely going to use him. I'll show him. Actually, I'm not going to open any more packs because I'm going to save some salary to play with them. But I'll show you him right now. Let's see. I got Terry Cummins. Terry Cummins is beast. Oh, he's way down here. Uh, let's see. 83 inside isn't that great. He's got a 90 dunk. That's up high. He's got a 65 pass, which is good for a big man. 90 low post defense. <clears throat> 99 rebound. Ooh, 75 speed. That's where it's at right there. Good stamina rating, good durability. Nice vertical. So it looks like he's pretty much athletic and a good defender. So let's see what I'm going to put on him. Posterizer. you got to put posterizer on him. And let's see. I guess defensive anchor. Yeah. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this pack opening. I got a player at the end. I clutched it. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.